Okay, so one of the requests I've had is to, how can you make sure that um, somebody doesn't pinch your work, your artwork, your graphics, for example, um, if you choose to put them on your website? So I'm going to show you how to watermark your images. So what I've done is come to Canva. I've got the, um, the pro version, but you can easily do this with um, a free version as well. So I would just, I'm just going to use social media graphic and this is done. I've already uploaded artwork that I want to upload. So obviously, if you're not used to Canva, then maybe we can just do a proper session on Canva another time. Um, but you need to upload your graphics to your upload section. And I've just got one here. So I'm just going to pop that onto there. I'm going to stretch it out so it fills um, the whole screen. Just for demonstration purposes. I've just got this from Pixabay. I've never um, used this. So I'm going to show you how to add a logo graphic and I'm going to show you how to add text. So if you wanted to add your website, for example, or your name, um, my advice is do not put it on like around the edges of your graphic because people are so crafty that they will just crop the image to crop out your logo or crop out your name. So I always try and put it in a place where they can't crop it out. So what you need is your logo um, or graphic um, that has a transparent background, which I've got mine here already. Um, and I'm just going to make it small. Um, so you can just you can just simply pop it in a location that is not going to take, you know, like distract it away from um, away from the actual design itself so you could just you know you could just maybe pop it there then what you want to do you can um you can just make it transparent so it doesn't show up as bad do you know what i mean so you can just you can just pop it anywhere pop it on the roof um you can you can make it bigger it, it depends on the image that you're working with um it's easier like yeah it just depends so you just place it i would just probably just make it a transparent background or just pop it in the middle um you know wherever you feel that it sits that is not like do not put it down here yet because people will just crop it off unless this is a lot of detail um i wouldn't i would definitely definitely not put it in the middle um if you just want a text you would um just click text and you can just add some text for example so you just put um kellycairs.co.uk can't spell my own name and again that will just you just place that somewhere just somewhere you know in the picture you can change the, the color of it you can change it to a gray color it, it just de really depends on the on the um the image that you're working with um you know if if obviously if the if a logo doesn't work you can simply just pop your name somewhere and just make sure that nobody can actually pinch your images so you don't have to worry if somebody does pinch your images and your and your watermark is there it's really difficult for them to take the watermark out um of an image you can make that bigger if you want you can make it darker you can make it white whatever um as long as it's there because if somebody tries to crop out your image like save your image they can't crop out something that's in the middle of the image or it's on like a a roof for example do you know what i mean they need to have some really good um good photocopy and uh, photoshop skills to be able to do that um, so yeah so that's how you add a watermark to um an image to you know hopefully just give you a little bit of reassurance that if somebody does try to lift your image from your website that wherever they take it your name's going to be on it and i would suggest that you put your website on it or your business name for example so that it's easy identifiable should somebody try and pinch it off your website so hopefully that helps um yeah and and i guess the age age old question is how can you stop people from doing it you can't you can install things on your website to stop people from you know like right clicking and saving stuff or right clicking and copying stuff but there's still copy and paste um you know off i, I don't know off other applications there's still screenshots there is no way that you can stop people from doing it but what you can do is safeguard um what your work by adding watermarks to it so I hope that helps.